Okay, so fifth Kubitechi. So this one's all about entering and turning, entering and turning. Okay, a little bit more complicated than the others maybe. Uh, anyway, so here we go. Okay, so this is another one where he has to have a bit more time on me. It's kind of like in the middle of something. It's the first move is for me to move at 90 degrees to him. If I can do that, I can move 45 degrees to him a bit quicker, or I can move uh, less angle quicker still. So I see it as, you know, he's got some time, he's coming in to me. So when I open up, I'm thinking about escaping that cut there. So the feeling I use is I'm escaping here, and I leave, I'm using this as a, a shield, it doesn't actually. Uh, contact. From here, I turn into a cut. He brings his uh, back foot forward, level with his front, brings the tip of the saw up, and then brings it down to deflect. By doing it in that way, it also makes the whole thing more consistent of uh, entry, turn, entry, turn. He then does a cut. Here. Now, I push forward here with the intention of coming in to take his sword, perhaps, okay? But he picks up on that feeling, pushes back and then enters, and he's now going to cut to the leg. So I don't want that to happen, so I step, and I carry the cut down here. Okay, now when, at the end of this cut, my head looks completely open, so he comes up for the strike, and I simply carry that with the finishing cut. series. Uh, thanks for watching.